For the first time since 2019, Dumplings and Dancing is returning to the Heinemann Settlement School November 8th through the 10th. The event will feature traditional Appalachian cuisine, square dancing, live music, and more. Well, prior to the pandemic, uh, Dumplings and Dancing was uh, an event really focused on celebrating Appalachian culture, especially as it pertains to you know, the culinary aspects, uh, you know, food and that sort of thing. Um, and we hadn't done it for three or four years now, mainly because of the pandemic. And uh, we just thought it was time to bring it back. So we have a, a, a couple of chefs. Uh, we have uh, uh, Weta Michaels is coming out uh, from Lexington. And Kristen Smith is coming from Corbin. Uh, and a number of other uh, you know, instructors just to uh, give people a chance to learn about uh, Appalachian cuisine, how to prepare it. And... Uh, It'll be a great event. Uh, we have, uh, you know, some uh, square dancing and good music and good food. So it'll, it'll be a very fun event. Hideaway novelties, smoke and vape, coal run, Caney, South Williamson, journey into the extraordinary today at the 21 and over shop in town. Tickets for the event are $50 per person with proceeds going to help battle food insecurity in the region. You know, we have a very uh, robust uh, food waste program that helps the people in this area, uh, you know, kind of deal with food insecurity. Uh, we help people, you know, uh, grow their own food, that sort of thing. Uh, we work with, I think, around 70 families uh, each year. Uh, we provide them with uh, uh, gardening implements, uh, instruction. We'll come out to uh, their uh, home and help rototill their ground and provide mulch and fertilizer and seeds. Uh, it's been a program that's, you know, been part of our our campus for a lot of years. Uh, and so this uh, uh, fundraiser will be used to support that program. For more information and to register, go to Heinemann.org. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.